Oh, you need yeah. to you need to subscribe to the guy on Facebook. He, I don't know if you have already. Which guy? The person. Which guy? The person he's making. It. I don't know if you've liked his page. I I didn't know he had a page on Facebook. Yes, it, I'll send it to you after. It's like he's updating it. He's he's shown um the Winnie the Pooh book. My God, it's amazing. Genuinely glorious. Yeah, he comments on my videos actually. Um, yes, that's all. I like. I don't know. I, I think he, I, don't, I like the guy. He's really seems really. Uh, yeah, 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 he's a nice guy. Team, the team, the the, 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 the team working on it definitely are pretty awesome. Yeah, they um they have said like they're thinking about making the Kingdom Hearts two one, but we'll see. Cause like it's a lot harder because there's more work to it and whatnot. Because you have to go to it yeah. twice. And there's also a lot, I think the worlds themselves are probably more complex. Yes, that too. Like Pride Rock, definitely. Yes, Pride Rock, especially with the ability to move fast over it, I'm not sure how they'll do that. Uh, that um, they probably won't. I, they prob they'll probably just give you swiftness potions, like very no, high swiftness probably. potions. Yeah, I suppose. But I meant like, just just the fact that Pride Rock is so huge in itself, because you can go to the top and whatnot. Yeah, but there isn't, like, Pride Rock itself is pretty, it, it's pretty small, in terms no, of like, the amount of time it takes you to run around. No, it, it, like, in terms of, like, the design for Pride Rock is fairly straightforward, they, they just make a massive desert straight. No, but you know, no, but you know what I mean. Like, yeah, the bit where you yeah. you can jump off is like that. The bit where the bit at the beginning of Lion King, it, that bit's small, but the rest of it is a massive, like giant cliff. That thing's huge. Making that thing would be really hard because especially you've got to get the outlines of it right. You've got to get the bit where you walk up and stuff. So you've got to. It would be quite hard to do, I imagine. I know they did. Um, they did do some uh, videos of them building it, they um, attempted to create it, and it was like five ten minute parts or something like that, mm. of just creating that giant cliff surface, which is quite a long time when you think about it. Yeah. So it's nothing that's going to be easy, but oh well. It's, it's exciting what they've done. It's very impressive. Yeah, that's, that's, yeah I'm looking forward to it as well. I'm, it could be really, what's well, not could be really interesting. It's going to be very fun, and we have to play through without cheating. Yes, we will. Unless we really get stuck. Like, the very worst. Yeah, well, the I, very worst will just kind of... Uh, that, but uh, I, I know more what I'm doing, so I can help a bit more. <laughs> yeah. Like, this, the, the, you kind of got thrown straight into the deep end with this one. Yeah, I mean, the game's very easy. Like, we're in, it's very simplistic in the way that it's designed. Like, it's not too difficult to find stuff, but I just mm. didn't know what I was doing. <laughs> but it was, yeah. Yeah, it's great. Though. Oh well, it's really fun. It, I really enjoy it as well. It's a great map, very impressive. So it'll be interesting to see what they do afterwards. I know um, one of the team members created the clock town from the Jura's mask. Um, and, oh, it's from Jura's mask. Yeah, someone recreated clock town from it. That's pretty impressive. Yay, second! Hi.